Yes, I want you to know that God hurts when you hurt. It doesn't make any difference what kind of a, a pain or an aggravation that you'd have in your life, whether it's mentally, physically, spiritually, financially, emotionally, whatever it is. I want you to know that uh, as I study the Bible, and I could spend an hour giving you scriptures to validate that God co-equally experiences the same type of aggravation that you're going through because uh, God loves you that much. And not only does God hurt when you hurt, but he does it supernaturally. And so, and that, that's powerful to know that. But you know what is more powerful than that is that God wants you to give him your cares. Let him know what problems that you've got that's burdensome to you and uh, cast them on him because he cares for you. 1 Peter chapter 5, verse 7, the Bible says, cast all your care on him for he cares for you. And so God wants to remove those. So it's, it's a wonderful thing to know that God hurts when you hurt, but it's a better thing to know that he could remove the hurt. And I'm going to tell you how that God removes it. Your part is, to sum it up, would be Isaiah 26.3. The Bible says, perfect peace will I give those whose mind is stayed on me. As you study the Bible, you find that God and his word are co-equal terms. And so how you get those hurts removed is keeping your mind stayed on God, stayed on his word. Let me give you a, a scripture that uh, if you'll memorize this, it'll help remove all the problems that you have. And that's how you cast it on him, by keeping your mind stayed on this. Uh, Psalm 16 and verse 11 is a very good passage of Scripture. It says, Thou wilt show me the path of life. In thy presence is fullness of joy, and at thy right hand there are pleasures forevermore. And the word life says that God will renew our life. Fullness is he gives satisfaction. So in God's presence, these things take place. That's how that you cast all your care on him by keeping your mind stayed on scriptures that gives you relief, gives you victory. Amen.